All right, guys, welcome back. Um, remember the last episode we made that bull in cave, or at least some of it. I haven't completed it yet, but yeah. Um, but also, we are going somewhere else. Now, where we're going to go, guys, is actually pretty far. It's not that far away. It's about a thousand blocks away. Um, it's not that far away, so we should be able to head over there now. So it's about 14 by 12, so um, if you're already the wrong way. So it's this way by... It's not... can't be that way. Mm. Mm. Alright, let's get there now, guys. So the first one to get there will be just straight down this way, and then it can't be that way. That makes no sense. No, it makes no sense, guys. Aha! And you know why it makes no sense? I'm going the right way with the set of coordinates. But it's minus. It's this way. Okay, that makes more sense. All right. Let's get there about 12.50, guys. So that's where we're going to go. Uh, it's going to take a few minutes to get there. I've got my coordinates locked down in my house, so I shouldn't get lost. Um... We've got a village here, guys, we can really use um, at some point. That's why I'm keeping it. We've got a lot of, um, how can I say, illegal operation thing ready to be done down here. So going this way, guys, it could take a while. I was thinking about putting it on, on um, peaceful so I can just get down there without worrying about the, um, what do you call it, running out. Running out of food, basically. I don't care about the night part. I'll we'll probably get there before it gets dark, but... More about the food part. We'll grab this stuff since we're here. So yeah, guys, once we're done here, we move on to the next game, which I'm hoping we can get there today. Um, worst case scenario, we save in that area and start planning up. Now, remember, guys, this is about a thousand blocks away from my house, so I can build a portal there at some point. It's not super distancy. A portal, a never portal, as I call them, will be the best thing to do. Um, almost there, guys. Not that far away. And then it's this way, I think. Yeah. Generally, I find it easy just to go one direction instead of doing both at the same time. Especially if there's other things in the way. Like, in this case, there's a mouse in front of me, so... Let's get this done. Up this, guys. I'm probably going to take about 20 to 20 minute break before I do my, um, my space one. I'll start cleaning up, I think. I've got to start being a bit more responsible. Even though everyone knows I hate cleaning up. Not really a, I guess what male likes cleaning up, I guess. I mean, I really respect the uh, females sometimes, because they're usually generally who clean up, but... As the years have gone, things have changed a little bit, so a lot of guys, I've got a lot of male friends who can clean up really well. Even though it's more of a... I think it was more of a female thing, but hey. I, maybe I'll just live in the old days, huh? But only one purpose, guys, of life. Um, there's also another village over there. That's interesting. At least getting there won't be hard. I can just get a boat. Um, hey, guys. One purpose for life that is to make more life. Basically, that's it. That's all you gotta do. I mean, it sounds very um, generic and definitely boring considering a lot of animals do that. But because they don't have the, uh, the IQ, they can't do much in other. So they can't make a better world for their own, I guess, race, I guess we call it, species, what do you wanna call them? But humans, we have the opportunity to make life better. And I think we do have the opportunity, we should take it. I think it's, I mean, I know some of the things we make are not beneficial to this planet, like, you know, um, I don't know, like nuclear weapons, for example, but here's the thing about technology. Technology is not necessarily bad or evil. It's how it's used. Um, so, like, nuclear bombs were created, what, ages ago, and then they start using them for, um, well, they start trying to use them for um, coal, nuclear power. Now that, on the other hand, is really good for the, for the world, guys. Nuclear power is useful. 
gives you a lot of power. It can be a bit dangerous if you don't have the um, updated, like, um, you don't have a decent power plant that can be... Keep an eye on if it has a meltdown or not, because that's the only thing about nuclear power that's really a concern to most people, is they meltdowns. Which I do understand that. I mean, it is dangerous in that regard. Um, hopefully, I'm hoping, guys, in the future, nuclear fusion... Fission will be the past, and nuclear fusion will be the future. Because they're both very different. They're both nuclear technologies. But how they do things is different. So, fission um, is uh, basically splitting up the atom. Oh, goodness gracious. Yeah, so nuclear fission is uh, splitting up the atom. So, using it for nuclear bombs, for example, which we should not be using it for. Um, also, there's another one called nuclear or cold fusion or nuclear fusion, which is basically the same principle as our sun. Our sun uses it. So that's basically con um, combining the two. That's where we are. That's where we should be, guys. We've got to work out. We should be able to get to that technology soon. I wouldn't be surprised 20, 30 years, maybe. Once that technology is out, that a lot of things will change. I'm hoping it will change, but the corporates of the world may not agree with it. Of course, the power that think, um, cold fusion can produce is limitless. There's a huge amount of power. The coil won't need much of them. The coil won't need that much to power up the whole planet. Even the third world countries, like, oh, I don't know, China's particularly third world. I think it's more what, second world, isn't it? I mean, China's done a lot of modernizing, um, catching up to a lot of other countries. I mean, love or hate China, they do have their benefits. And besides, a lot of people who have issues with those countries don't have an issue with the country itself, just the... Uh, a lot of governments, I mean, but I don't have an issue with American governments, so I have an issue with every government, so it doesn't matter which government. Even my own government I have an issue with. But we need to live in the next age. Oh, my God. All right. Get running almost there, guys. Come on to this. Uh, yeah, we should be almost there. I think I know where we are. That's the swamp. Just over there. According to the calculations, we should be about five minutes away. There's the sand. There's the swamp, guys. We'll work out where we are. Work out the village, guys. We can write down the corners, make sure it's 100%. I can start building a village over here. I can use the Never Travel uh, travel to it, and then I can edit the Never Travel, so we can I can move the villages from one spot to another without too much activity. I mean, I think the only one you really got to worry about is mending, I believe. I think everything else can be done everywhere else. Um, I want mean, to go drown down here, probably. Almost there, guys. So, yeah, this one's a very quick episode. Just want to make it there, guys. That planning our future. Um, where is it? Fourteen sixty. So it's about a hundred blocks away. A hundred blocks. So it should be just over here. Yeah. So it's in the in the savanna, savanna. So it should be just up ahead, because that's where we are now, in a way. I mean, once we start doing that, guys, if we get mending, great, it'll be good. Because means we no longer have to worry about um, weapons breaking every five seconds and making 60 tools. Okay, we're here. So the town's in about the same spot. Yeah, it's pretty accurate, guys. I mean, it's not 100%. Actually, yeah, it's pretty accurate. It's a village town that... Oh, it links here. So that's what, when you put the corners. That actually, this is the centre of the town. So um, let's go to bed. 
I didn't think about bringing um, let's see what's in here. Emeralds, or this stuff would be useful. Emeralds are useful, that's useful, that's useful. Grass is not. Alright, so now the plan is, guys, we've got to work out how far away exactly is the, um, is the swamp. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we're here, where's the swamp, um, I'm assuming the swamp's this way, I'm assuming, I'm not 100% sure, yeah, don't bother attacking me dude, oh, oh. where'd you come from, oh right, the swamp's over here, perfect, I think it's the swamp, no, that's just built normal trees, look at it, Oh, no, it's, some can't be that far away. So that's the um the bush area. Yeah, okay, that's the desert. That's the desert. Yeah, it's got to be over there. Luckily for us guys, I can tell easily where it is. Oh yeah, that's, I'm assuming it's this way. Let's check it out, guys. Just to make sure I'm right, so we don't. Have any issues? Um, last thing I want to do, guys, is have an issue. So I might be in here for a few, a few episodes, guys, building up our area. Uh, I want to get the thing done. What we can do here, guys, is great because it's mostly water, so I can easily move the villages around. And yet, this is where it is, guys, right here. You can see the um. So first things first, we can probably dig up an area around here. Around here, guys. Build a house like here or something, and then just build a big a a way to get the villages across. That's basically all you gotta do. But I think we need some trees, get some wood, make a small house. Now, where am I gonna put my house? I don't know yet. I could put it over here, but it's a bit far away to get to all the time. But yeah, we've got a few plans, guys. So this one will take a bit longer. It will take probably a few episodes. Um, I'm hoping there's caves nearby to make it. So for a while, we won't be doing too much things at my main base, at least early on. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Um, so we're going to be making a small house, guys. This area, actually, I'm going to make a different type of house, a house completely different than I'm mean making. So maybe it will require a little bit more effort. But it's only going to be a small house. It's not going to be super big or anything. Um, Where's my village? There it is. I gotta be careful. So what I wanna do guys is build a house around let's say here. So around here? But I wanna make it like underground. So we're gonna have some glass there and all that shit. Um so we're gonna be like around here. We're gonna get that sorted out pretty quick soon enough. Um is there a cave around here that we can use to Oh hold it. There's a cave down there. That looks like a cave. That looks like cave ish. It's okay, right? That's gonna save us a lot of time. All right, we can start building a house around here, guys. So here will be perfect because I can put it up. I can make a little, like a little door area to come up and down, or I can make a door going downwards. I don't know which way. I'll actually make a door going downwards. It seems more interesting. Um, so we've got enough stuff. Which basically, I don't know how long we've been playing this for. I don't think it's been that long. So yeah, let's get started now. First things first. We can put things away that we don't need. All right, but second, we need some trees. Um, these trees aren't the greatest trees, but they'll do for now. Uh, who keeps sending me messages? I swear to God, my phone's gonna get exploded. Like guys, just one of my old, some of my old friends. I'm really thinking about removing some friends. But I don't have any benefit. They're just depressing. I mean, the last episode I complained a little bit, but I got over it now. Um. So what I'm gonna start doing. 
I'm gonna build it right here, guys. So this is where the house is gonna start. It's gonna be right there, yeah, yeah. There, yeah, perfect. So here'll be perfect. Go downwards a little bit like that. I'll be a few levels down, guys. Um, let's get our house started, guys. So I'll be a little bit further down, not too much further down. I don't want it too far down. One more should be enough. Yeah, yeah, perfect. I think he's okay. Now, how far across am I going to make it? I've got no idea. But at least for the moment, I can put something down here and... Yeah, do that. Okay, we'll get some stuff stored out. We can make it... One of these are great, great, great. That's a good start. I don't need a farm, guys, because I'll be using my main farm for this. Great, that's a start. That's a good start, guys. Now we've got that going. Um, do we have any cobblestone? Yeah, we do. Great, that means we can do two things. Um, five. I hear an enemy. I hear an enemy. Yeah, okay. Hello, dude. Alright, so we're gonna grab that, let's grab some sticks. I wanna become a stickman. I wanna be a stickman. Alright, get two of them and two of them should be enough. I wanna to go to the caves for a few minutes, see what's down here and what we can do. So this area for the early time being guys will be I'll mostly use. Just until we get the base sorted out and once that little area is sorted out guys, it's only gonna be like maybe I'm probably going to make it like 10 by 10, and that'll be it. And then I'll make some glass up there and just decorate it a little bit, and then we can basically move on to the next part of the development. But this is the beginning of our house, guys. This is going to be an underground house. So we're starting. It's going to take a while, but I like building, I like building guys. So obviously that's why it's going to take a while. All right. Um, I don't really want to. Hold, I want to hold on to a torch because you know uh, I don't know if you noticed. Oh, oh I did not know I took that. I thought I left it back at base. Thank God I took it. I hate it when it's dropped like this, guys. Do I have a bucket? Um, no. All right, guys, we'll just have to take a chance. Aha! Got some water at least. Make it a little bit easier to get down. Oh, damn, it's only a little bit of... Oh, no, don't tell me this is one of those caves. That has nothing down here. No, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe there's something over here. If I can get up there like this, um... Hopefully it takes me somewhere. Oh, good. But no. It, no, it might take me up. Or maybe. I don't know yet. It looks very suspicious, so... I would like three bits of coal and some iron. Anyway, guys, um, we are going to finish up early here because we're going to plan for our next video, which will be basically doing what we did for the beginning part. So get some coal, get some iron, do some digging, you know, get the, get the resources up. Um, coal is probably going to be the thing we really need, though. Now let's have a look up. Is there anything up that way? Is it just dead end? I think it's dead end, guys. Yep, you're fucking dead end. Getting out of here might be a problem, actually. Yeah, getting out of here is going to be a big problem. I don't even know if we can get out of here. I don't even know if it's a... Oh, I guess we can start digging. Right, now the cat's talking, guys. Um, I'm going to finish up in a minute, in a way. The next video, we'll continue down here. I'm groping what's left of the cobblestone. Digging our way out. Uh, looking for caves that are... Man, um, uh, basically useful. 
And at the moment, this cable is not one of them. But we did get some iron out of it, so it's not a total loss. And we're getting a lot of this stuff, so we can just dig our way out. Hopefully, we can find something else out. Um, this one, like I said, episode is a bit smaller because I just want to get this out the way. We found the area. That the main part of this video was to find a swamp. Now, simple fact was the swamp was much closer than I expected, so... Normally it's a bit further away, so it takes longer to get to, so that's what I was allocating it to. So I already started with our village and all that, I'm out of town, a house, whatever you want to call it. We've got to be looking for a good cave, and then we can start using it. Because once we do that, guys, and we can find lava, it'll be great, because that means we can make obsidian, and I can head back to my other area, which I don't know the coordinates of. So I couldn't even use it if I wanted to. Okay. So yeah, that's what we're going to do guys. On that note, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm going to save it here. Cheers.